Mayor Stephanie Rawlings Blake swore in a new city council member today. Eric Costello will be representing downtown Mount Vernon and Federal Hill. But John Rydell live at City Hall at this time saying how he was chosen is causing a lot of controversy down there. John. He was not elected by the voters, but Eric Costello was actually appointed by a special commission. And tonight here at City Hall, he was officially approved by members of the city council. I, I, Eric Costello, do swear. Do swear. Just moments after being confirmed by the city council, Eric Costello becomes its newest member. He calls his appointment humbling. I'm really looking forward to working with everyone. Uh, to make not only the 11th district better, but to help strengthen our city. Costello won unanimous support from the 12 city council members present. <laughs> he had been appointed by a special committee of community leaders, appointed by council president Jack Young. He beat out 13 other candidates. Eric Costello, in my opinion, stood above the rest of them, and that's why he was nominated. Mr. President. But Young has been criticized by some community leaders for the selection process. After hearing from all 14 contenders over several hours, the committee quickly voted. And what do you say to, um, what do you say to critics that say that this was just a, a done deal, that five minutes after the, the hearing, the commission uh, took a vote. Well, the commission heard everybody that was standing up there. Most of them took notes. But Young admits a special election may be needed in the future to head off any controversy. As for Costello, who heads the Federal Hill Improvement Association, he says he's just focused on serving everyone in the 11th district. One of the things that I'd like to focus on is striking an appropriate balance between economic development and community involvement in that development uh, to make sure that smart development's occurring. Well, Eric Costello officially replaces Bill Cole, who resigned after he was appointed by the mayor to become the new head of the Baltimore Development Corporation. We're live at City Hall, John Rydell, Fox 45 News.